Hi, welcome to Take Tips and Take Stuff. My name is Ron, and today I'm going to give you my honest opinion on Vegas Pro 18. But before I start, if you're new, please subscribe to this channel for more Vegas Pro tutorials. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for subscribing. You're like my best friends. So let's get back to Vegas Pro 18. Vegas Pro 18, uh, I've been running all, I ran it all day yesterday, and I had problems at night using lower thirds. It was crashing, it kept crashing and crashing, crashing. But if I didn't use lower thirds, I had no problems with it. It was fine. And Vegas Pro 16, when I used lower thirds, crashed all the time. Which is a very, very unstable program. Vegas Pro 16, the latest, bird, the latest version, crashed all the time. So, in my opinion, if you're on the fence, whether to buy it or not, um, I'll put links in the description below, either affiliate links. If, if you decide to buy Vegas Pro 18, if you could please buy them from my affiliate link, because it helps out my channel. I do get a small commission if you purchase it from that from that link, and um, it would really help out my channel a lot. Um, but getting back to Vegas Pro uh, 18, and, uh, if you have Vegas Pro 17, if I were you, I'd stand, sit in the sidelines and wait for, for new newer features coming out. They promised more features coming out uh, later this month. Uh, I'm not sure what they are, they didn't say. So, if you, if you have Vegas Pro 17, I say I say hold off on getting 18. If you have anything below 17, like 16 or lower, I say go for it. Uh, it's a it's a good piece of software. But remember, it's a brand new release. There's going to be bugs. You cannot get away from bugs in a brand new release. So I want to be totally honest with you guys about this software. If you're running 17, I say hold off. Wait for the new features coming out. Don't buy it right now. If you have if you have 18, or sorry, 16 or lower, yes, jump in there and try it. You can always return it if it's too unstable and get a refund, or just wait for them to, to fix the bugs. So I just want to give you my honest opinion, guys. If you found this video helpful in any way, please give a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, thank you for watching.